Good morning guys! Welcome to Life with Lena and if you guys are new here, please click that red subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up! So I woke up to a super cute love poem text by Andre. He sent me a cute little love thingy this morning. My baby, yeah, and you gave me lots and lots of kisses this morning. You did. I'm gonna go see what my cold sore looks like right now. And I still have, I just, since I just woke up like half an hour ago, I have like two pills I still need to take. But yeah, let's go see what this cold sore looks like with four grams of those pills I took yesterday. Hopefully it'll be going away. Hopefully, keeping my fingers crossed. So let's go take off this white Abreva stuff and go see what it looks like. Well guys, that did not work. The four grams did not make this any smaller. Mm. I don't know if it looks the same or maybe even a little teeny bit bigger than when I went to bed yesterday, but hopefully it doesn't grow any bigger than this and it just goes down from here. The doctor said three days of those pills. <laughs> he only gave me enough for three days for eight, 12. Yeah, he only gave me enough for three days. So hopefully it goes away within those three days. Yeah, not so sure if that's gonna go away, but hopefully it does. All right, guys, well, mm, yeah. Um, Hopefully this goes away tomorrow, today. That would be good. I'm gonna take my two pills right now. The next thing that's gonna happen to my cold sore is that the liquid, um, that it's kinda like gonna burst. So then the liquid is gonna like drain out. Cause right now it just looks like a bubble blister. You guys see like a whole bunch of liquid in there right now, or I mean, you don't see the liquid, but it just looks, uh, you know, like a blister, like it's filled with liquid. So, so the next thing that's gonna end up happening is that it's gonna like pop and the liquid is like gonna drain out. All right, Mr. Cutie Patootie? Yeah, that's exactly what's gonna happen. Yeah. So we need to make some breakfast. I don't know if there's avocados ready. Oh no, I can't make those lines. No, 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 no. I can't make that face. This might be a little harder to make today, but I still want to eat it. So we're just gonna toast some bread and we're trying out a new recipe today. I'm also starting to think that I'm getting cold sores because when my mom gets hers, she always touches hers and I'm always like, stop freaking touching your cold sore because then you touch something else and then the germs are on there. So I'm starting to think I just get them because of my mom. So I got Lysol. We are disinfecting literally everything right now. All right, you can disinfect that. Any handles and anything. My mom literally touches her cold sore all the time, and I can't stand it. All doorknobs. Light switches. What else, what else? Ooh, this would be good. Toilet handles. Who's calling me now? I'm in the middle of a very important thing right now. Um, yeah, I don't know, some random collect call or something from Arizona, not answering. Okay, back to spraying everything. You know what, I think I'm gonna spray down my desk because my mom likes to sit at my desk too. Oh, it smells like Lysol in here. It's cray cray. A little strong for me, <laughs> but uh, whatever. I'm gonna spray down the handles downstairs to the door too. I think we're okay. Now, if I get a cold sore, next time my mom gets one, I'm gonna spray down everything once again. Hopefully I won't get a cold sore. But my mom has been getting them a lot too, and every time she gets one, I seem to follow hers not too long later, so. Yeah, okay, sprayed everything down, and I go get my toast now. Okay guys, I made my brunch. <laughs> it's 12.17, so I guess this is brunch. I didn't eat my chia seed pudding yet because I needed to make an avocado toast recipe, but here's a new one, guys, and look how beautiful it looks. I hope this tastes good. Why didn't I think of putting cucumber on my sandwiches before? I was doing just tomatoes and I love cucumbers. I actually love cucumber, tomato, and egg on a sandwich like that. It's really good. So why didn't I think of this before? I don't know. It was good though. No avocado toast for you, mister. 
No, 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 no. He really doesn't like the camera in his face. He always turns. And the cold sore just burst, guys. I don't know if you guys could see. It's not um as poofy. Poofy, is that the right word? But that's what it looks like now. That right there is like dry skin on the side. Um, but you see how it's not like all bubbly and liquidy now? Well, that's what happens with cold sores. I feel like I want to start like a food Instagram account. I don't know. I've been posting food pictures on my personal, which some of you guys follow me there. Um, so I've been posting like pictures here and there, but my personal is still like, you know, pictures of me or pictures of me and my boyfriend. And I feel like the photo, the food photos that I posted don't really fit into my feed. I don't know. And I feel like I want to start like a separate Instagram of just food, but at the same time, I don't know if I'll be able to post every day because it's not like I make something every single day and like I don't know if that matters. Look how out of the, out of place these avocado toast pictures look on my Instagram. I don't know, I feel like they look out of place. I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Should I just keep it since I don't post it that often or should I actually make a food Instagram? Let me know. Making some French vanilla cappuccino. Totally okay to add marshmallows into your coffee, right? Marshmallows, come back to me. Sitting here watching KK and Baby J vlogs. Well, this guy just keeps like, what are you doing? No, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, come here. I just want to cuddle with you. Okay, let's watch KK and Baby J. Let's watch Baby Jackson. And hope Landon comes. Come on. Oh, he left the building again with his butt right there. <laughs> okay, so one of you guys just commented on my cold sore video. What is her name? I hope I'm saying this right. Anka Avram? Anka Avram? I don't know. So she told me that I should be taking something to boost my immune system. She recommended like this tea thing, kind of like for flu, but not really. I don't know. So I decided I would just take probiotics. I used to take them. Which is maybe why now, since I haven't taken them when we get, I'm getting cold sores. I used to take them, but now I don't, so maybe that's why I've been getting cold sores. I don't know. So, um, I will start taking probiotics again. I will add them to my nice little pill box that I seem to fail on. Like, what's today's date? Today is Tuesday. Yeah, this hasn't been filled for like, I don't know, two weeks now. <laughs> I should probably like take those pills. I take them here and there when I remember, but I need to get better on that. So maybe like I'll set up alarms for my phone like day and night. Then an alarm for me to take those pills. Actually, I think that's a great idea. Um, I'm going to set those alarms up right now. And I ordered probiotics. So those should be here in a couple of days and then I can start taking them. And then hopefully I won't get any more cold sores this year. So I set up my alarms for 11 a.m. and 10 p.m. for my pills. And then the other top two are my wake-up alarms, even though I have not yet been waking up at that time. But we're still trying. Apparently, I just also need to drink some more ginger water because apparently it's a good uh, immune... It's good for your immune system. I was going to say immune booster, but it's good for your immune system from the research I just did on my computer, which is what I've been doing. I've been researching, watching videos. Was I not recording this whole time? I thought I was recording. I was talking to you guys. So I just cut up some ginger, put it in my little tumbler, or we're going to fill it up with water. I guess it'll, it'll be good. I mean, I, lo I love ginger water anyway, so this isn't really like a chore. And I have to take my other pills from today. Not the um, not the prescription ones for my cold sore, but I have to take my MSM. I take that, and then I take my lysine pills. The MSM one is so hard to take. It's not coated in like a plastic. Like the lysine one is coated in a plastic, and the MSM one is not. And it's so much bigger. <laughs> it's so hard to take. This one's so hard to take. This one's easy. This one's hard. So I always like take forever taking it. And the MSM one has like a really bad aftertaste. All right, lysine pill is down. MSM. Ah, okay. That one requires a lot more concentration. <laughs> okay, in my office now, and now we're gonna film a main channel video. I'm gonna make like a Valentine's Day card. I think I'm gonna use my Silhouette machines. I'm not sure yet, but I also just, I'm snacking on some bread right now. I love bread. But I'm gonna make a Valentine's Day card. I hope it comes out cute. I just want to make it for this video today. And although it's not a planner video, it's um, still stationary, which is like my Monday videos are planning or like stationary or like 
silhouette cameo creations or I don't know things like that anything related to stationery is on Mondays my Monopoly game is so nice that it folds up and fits into a gallon size bag and then I put all the pieces and things like that put them in a smaller quart size bag there we go there's my like a travel size Monopoly this is actually very like travel friendly if you want to take Monopoly on the go Alright guys, so I just finished filming my video. I made a Valentine's Day card. Look how beautiful it is. Um, so that's my video today and this is a card I'm actually going to be giving to Andre. Nice beautiful handmade card for Valentine's Day. I made a huge mess on my floor though. Yeah, this, this is my mess. And I made this nice mess right here, over there, plus over there. A little bit of a mess here too. Got lots of cleaning to do right now. These fire trucks are not letting me do a voiceover. So I'm trying to do a voiceover on the video I just filmed today and there's fire trucks and cops that just keep going by and they're not letting me do my voiceover. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I've had to like redo it like a million times already. Never ending guys, I hear more. I don't know if they're walking, driving through. Yep, yep, they're about to drive through. Never ending, I think something really big happened. This is the second fire truck now. So I just had to change my pajamas into some legging pajamas because it's just now that time of the month and you guys know when it's that time of the month I don't like a onesie pajamas. I like leggings, something that keeps everything in place But I wasn't supposed to get it for like three days, which is fine with me It's actually better this way because on Thursday we have a concert to go to We're going to see the Lumineers on Thursday night and then Saturday to Sunday We might be going to Atlantic City and then at least my period won't be at, at its heaviest then when normally it was going to be because I was supposed to get my my period on Thursday actually so it would have been at my heaviest on Friday Saturday but now it's kind of better so if we do go Atlantic City I don't have to like worry about it so much so yay I guess it happened to come at a good time just heated up some food okay this is really hot and here's my dinner it's a lot of peppers some kind of beef I think I don't really know apparently my dad just told me this is actually Hungarian food <laughs> So this is what I'm eating for dinner. So my video is exporting, I'm eating, and we're gonna watch some, a movie, I guess? I don't know, we're gonna watch, you know what? Yeah, I was gonna watch Taken, but maybe not. Changed my mind, we're gonna watch some Netflix. Figured I would watch some more, what, what was this? Um, Good Witch. I'm not on, am I on episode four? Is this what I'm on? I think so. I like that Netflix keeps your place, guys. So we're watching Good Witch, there we go. And my video is uploaded. You guys should check it out if you guys want to make a card too. I love how it came out. It looks so beautiful. So I also read this morning that another good thing for boosting your immune system is yogurt. So I'm having a peanut butter dream Chobani right now. I love this one. This is like one of my favorite ones. So I figured I would snack on this right now and I took my uh, cold sore pills, the Valtrex. All right guys, I got some Abriva on my lips and we're gonna get ready for bed. I'm, I'm gonna watch a couple of more YouTube videos, or not more, I'm gonna watch a couple of videos because I've been watching um, the Swatch, this good witch thing. So yeah, I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe down below if you haven't done so already and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Say goodnight, mister. Say goodnight. Bye.